Hello, beautiful people. Like, share, and subscribe. Uh, so the governor of uh, Sokoto State is on the wasteful spirit. Wasteful spirit. And you see why on my channel I call that we should scrap this governorship system. It's a waste of time. The whole thing must be restructured, restructured and I will tell you how. Uh, so the governor of uh, people of God PDP calls for EFC's investigation into Sokoto's uh, state government. Uh, 30 billion naira street fencing projects. Listen, no, 30 billion naira. Uh, just for you to understand how big this money is, Tinibu spent 150 billion naira, I think, on the private jet. Now the governor is spending uh, one over five of that money to show you the scale of this money. Now, before that time, the governor spent 1.2 uh, billion on repairing 25 boreholes and another 1.2 billion for renovating five roundabouts. So he's, a, he's, he's on a spending spree. And you can see the poster, he's saying you to clock. You know, this Nigeria, eh? If Nigeria is not restructured, we cannot go forward. Look at the local government uh, autonomy that Supreme Court passed. Tinibu cannot pass it because he wants to please the governors because of criminality in the system. A whole Supreme Court gave order up to now. Hey, go. which kind of useless country is this? It is a country you're saying investors should come and invest. Country that people don't respect law because he wants to please the governors. Anyway, uh... I don't understand this uh, Nigeria. If you just look at it, it's just a waste. I've mentioned we should scrap this governorship system. Many of the governors are not doing anything. Let's have six mayors. You understand what I'm saying? This is geopolitical zones, so that the attention will be focal on those people. Do you understand what I'm saying? Let's uh, uh, go the system. Let me tell you, South African uh, system of government is better for us. The way we are doing it is not working. We already have six regions. Let them have six mayors. Scrap the governor. So there will be a focal point. Now we have that six governors. Many of them are not doing anything. It's not like even if you have the six mayors mm -hmm. that uh, it guarantees anything. But at least there will be focal point. People will focus on instead of blaming Tinibu and everything, you know. And like for me, uh, industrial tax will belong to the region. So that it will make the people to work very hard. While uh, solid and liquid minerals, we can share it equally. It, all those solid and mini, mi, liquid mineral, they say it doesn't it doesn't actually mean anything, because there are many countries that are rich in resources in Africa, and it, it didn't move it, it didn't promote, it, it make the country grow. Look at Japan, they don't have any resources, they are doing fine. Countries like Ireland, which resources do they have? So if you don't have resources, you must think out of the box to be able to remove your people from poverty. And Nigeria is a country almost all the regions have fertile soil. So let's have one ceremonial president, six mayors. Uh, representing the six regions and they will be in charge of the funds so that they will grow to be uniform if they want to build schools they will build uh, schools uniformly if they want to build hospitals it's just like a way of regional government but in this time around it's better structured then you have the local government the local governments will just be there for things like maintenance and you know they will give them little power you understand so and there will be no immunity for any of them both the mayors and the this thing mayors and the local government we're just wasting time in this country big wasting time let me know your thoughts in the comment section 30 billion naira they should continue